Installing and configuring Vectric for the Onefinity CNC. Start by setting up and logging into your personal Vectric account. Once you're logged into your account, you will scroll down and we'll see this red button that says Download Now. That'll bring up our next page where we will download the installer. Once that installer is finished downloading, we can click on it to open it. Start by selecting your language. Next, our setup guide will pop up. We'll just click Next. We can then agree to our license agreement. On components to install, we will select whatever version of Vectric we have as well as the shell extension. We are downloading Aspire 11.0 and then we'll click Next and we'll wait for this to load. Once that's done loading, we can click Finish and Vectric will open. With Vectric open and running, we will select File, then select New. At the top of the page, we'll select Machine, and on that drop-down, we will search for Machine Online. This is going to download the archive of machines and post-processors that Vectric has. Once those are done downloading, we will be asked to select our manufacturer, which is Onefinity. Next, we're going to select our series, Journeyman, Machinist, Woodworker. Our model is the X35 or X50. We're using an X35 and our configuration will be default. Here we can see the default configuration is preloaded and we can select Onefinity inch or Onefinity millimeters at the bottom. We can also click on the list and scroll down to find our laser post processors. With our post processors installed, we're ready to click OK, and now we can start designing and creating toolpaths.